Hello, MechWarriors! How is it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. Guys, today I want to go ahead and build a thing. Our Hellcat needs to get on the battlefield, and I think we're going to prioritize getting that thing up and running today. So here's the, here's the deal. We're going to go to a nice, cute industrial hub. Ideally... Yeah, I think we have a Cantina mission open, so I think we're gonna go down here to actually pick another one up. We need those upgrades points. It's super duper important. Also, we should probably take a look at our upgrade opportunities right now. So, let's see. We have five out of six. Uh, we could kill Igors. It's kind of easy to do. I don't like these pickup missions, but the best way to do it is in the early game when you are still mobile, huh? Uh, we get machine guns. Get one upgrade point, collect a Vulcan, also a thing that is not... Oh, that's a good LRM, though. Yeah, but we don't have a Vulcan, so I'm gonna go ahead and kill some Igors. You know, just some some regular good old uh, killing while we are killing anyway. Cool. We have a heavy chain cannon. That's a two-ton item for 18 million C-Bills. Ay, 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 ay. All of these weapons are fantastic. I want to try them. Also, we are supposed to pick these. Uh, sure. Pirate Scrap Rifle. Alright, I'm intrigued. 14 damage per second? What? Wait. You say 14 damage per second. That is a lot of damage per second for a 9-ton item. What's the deal here? We have an optimal range of 500 meters. Sure. Um... Uh -huh, uh -huh. It will have a lower velocity, but can literally fire anything. Scrap Rifles use 3 chain by rotary system. Uh, cool. Uh-uh-uh, let me see. Fire bursts of scrap metal in quick succession. The scrap rifle is in the middle of the scrap weapon series. I want it. I just want to see what this is all about. We also got some SRM-62 pirate. Uh, second rack. Oh, wait. Is it double SRM-6? That's pretty cool, man. I want all of this. I want to try all of it, but I need my money to build my mech. Oh. So... If there is scrap rifle ammo, I'm gonna pick up the scrap rifle. So, let's take a look. It's probably not here. I mean, maybe this this rifle uses different ammo? Where can I see it? Like, what kind of ammo do you use? Perhaps pirates, sure. Required mech lab level, whatever. Um, I don't see it. I just don't see it. Could be that it's just rifle ammo, like medium rifle ammo. But I think it has its own... It's own ammo type. Yes, we could pick up the weapon here and maybe find the ammo later. But let's focus down on our mech. Let's have our priorities straight, all right? I want the Hellcat, so we're gonna get that freaking Hellcat. Click the repair all button. Cry a little bit. <laughs> get the engine out of here and put a an XL. Oh god, three million. I want middle ground here. I think I want 250. Not 280. I like the speed that we have here. Mm. Alright, 280. So that means that we have 10 heat sinks with the double heat sink kit coming from the engine. That's perfect. Let's drop the broken things. Can we get there? 4.8. Looking good, actually. Uh, it costs us a lot of time. Uh, click the max armor button. We are not maxed out on that. And I think we're gonna start building from here. Medium pulse clan. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We still have a lot of room left. Okay, so let's put the ammo in the leg. Because we can. Alright. Split it up. And... I kind of want to have another laser weapon to be able to drop flying units. Something like... You know what? Like a good old ER large laser. That's that's a good one. Alright. Okay, that's... 2.6 damage per second. Range is 270. I think we have better medium lasers, which are... Half the tonnage of the medium pulses. Yeah, but overall we get more DPS out for the tonnage. Yeah, I have an idea here. We'll do it like that and add another short range missile on the side saucer. It's such a weird build. Oh, it's all over the place. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Quickly checking. Any other good LBX? We have an LB5. I'm not against the LB5 if we have the ammo for it. We do, but only one bin. 80 rounds capacity. Could be enough. Could be enough. Do we want to make it a close-range brawler or more like a long-range interceptor? Because if we go down to LRM, uh, sorry, LB5, we'd save two tons, I think. 
three tons even. That means we could upgrade the SRM to an LRM and be a bit more like at range. I think I'm fine though. Yeah, I th you know what? Let's not overcomplicate the things here. We're going to put a ton of SRM ammo in there. I think I'm going to drop a bit of lag armor. Let's drop it to like 50 or so. 50? 50 is the number. There we go. Um, yeah. 49, seemingly. 48. Still good enough. 47. Drop a bit of head armor? Probably not. Headshots are an actual thing here in this game. I usually drop a little bit of head armor in Mech Warrior Online because headshots are rare, like really rare. But here, the AI has, you know, sometimes they have a, a laser side to your face. So I think that's going to be the build. And here's the thing. It is affordable. So we got our LBX for some mid-range action. We have the ER Large Laser to soften up enemy flying units when they are closing in. And our brawling potential is the medium laser SRM LBX combination. Cooling is... Not good. Cooling is atrocious. Ha! So what are we doing with this? You know, I think for the moment we do nothing with it. Or, wait. Or I drop the 6 to a 4, because that's a tier 4 item as well. It saves us a ton and allows us to put another double heat sink in, as well as lowering over our overall heat. That's okay. We put it in the engine. It's safer there. All right. Yeah, large. I, I'm, I'm not really sold on it. I think we have to try. Could take a regular large laser. Dropping a bit of heat. Sacrificing range. You know what? Sure. It's alright. That feels better. It just feels better. So all of these weapons align in range now. So we have 500 meters here up to 900. We have 550 here up to 1000. I mean, this is short range. This is something that we shoot when enemies are close by. But this is great mid-range potential. I like it. And that's going to be our Hellcat. Let's start the work. All right. 181 days. So that guy is not going to come online in... Yeah, in days. Quick repair here. We have 85 days to gather money for our next upkeep. Holy moly. Um, yeah, where do we go? What do we have? Battlefield. Battlefield infiltration. That sounds fun as hell. And there's also a chance to find some mercenaries. Let's do it. Let's go here. Also... A little bit lower. And there's also an exploration that has spawned. Perfect. I do want to... I really do want to start building on the Kentaro as well. I want to make it my dedicated medium make LRM boat because it has a 25% bonus on damage for LRMs. Resource perfect. I'll take it. Alright. So. Mm, one more thing I wanted to do. Ah, exactly. Exactly. We'll take the, a look at the Thunderbolt. I mean, the biggest problem, problem is that... This guy is not painted. So, look at the Thunderbolt. Yes, thank you. Alright. And I click Paint Mag and then say Apply All. So, everybody's in the same colors. We also have our Hollander, which is at the brink of being good. I need a little bit more work on it. Just a little. And we can actually bring that Abomination to the battlefield. It's so cool, man. So, the skinny arms and the skinny legs. And then that massive torso with the gauss on top of it. I love it. And I, I really want to make it happen before it's getting irrelevant because it's, you know, too, too light. So, guys, first contract of the day. Let's start with the exploration directly. We need some... Ah, so that's possible. Um, We need some... Money, actually. Do we care for salvage? No. You know what? No, I can only get salvage here because it's a resource mission, obviously. So we'll take that. Right, confirm it. And also we need a fast mech. That's what I wanted to say, but didn't manage to say. 81 kph is probably good enough, to be honest. 95 on the Raven. That's a 160 ton mission. Ay ay ay. Ah, Kintaro is getting hot though. Let's take our good Shadowhawk as our main mech. 2D. And make this a... Nah, it's five tons over here. It's a fire starter. All right. So, you little guys, you gotta defend, and I'm gonna go and try to get things done. Let's see how this is gonna go. Uh, by the way, in one of my streams, um, a, a person was asking if I could make these videos a little bit longer. And I know that a lot of you have the same same idea, same sentiment here. 
Um, so I want to. I really want to. One thing is holding me back currently. All right. Quick check. All three bases relatively close together. One thing is holding me back, and that is currently a time, who would have thought. Um, I really want to try to balance my content so that all of my videos are about 45 minutes to an hour long. Problem right now is that Rogue Tech is in the absolute late game. That means <laughs> the missions there are like one and a half hours and maybe maybe even longer than that. I've been recording two and a half hour videos that I had to split in two in order to get those out in a reasonable way. Um, and since I'm the, I'm the home dad, uh, I have to take care of my son. I only have my mornings to record, so time is very, very... Um, limited right now. But here's the catch, guys. All of this leading up to... There is a new patch, a safe game-breaking patch for Rogue Tech that's coming. And that means we're gonna start from scratch. And that means we're gonna go back into the early game where the Don't missions are destroyed. definitely shorter. So Rogue Tech is gonna get cut Did back the from the massive Just one and a half, two hour videos. And I can push the Mac 5 videos a little longer then. So, you know, balancing the content right now. Um, so you can look forward to that roughly in December. For all of you Mac 5 crazies. That thing exploded? Ha! <laughs> Alright. Uh, there's probably something here, right? Come on. There has to be hidden caches here. I knew it! Alright, yeah. On those resource missions, there is just a, a lot of these things that you can find. Found an LRM5 level 2, by the way. Not bad. Brilliant. I'll take it. Those were just some C-bills. And I believe there's something there as well. You know what? I'll, I'll take a look. I really want to take a look. We'll take our time here, because we might find something. Looking for good weapon systems to put in my mechs, obviously. But what I look more for is actually more C-bills. Um, one of these uh, points there hopefully contains a million sea bills so there it is there it is called it there could be something here as well i want to quickly check sometimes they are close together no sure i'll take it and now we're going to start going to alpha there we go excellent find commander medium oh, medium now. rifle but level three Oh, you're not gonna make me run rifles, right? I could make it happen on the Hollander. Oh, man. There's a mech. It's a crap. Okay, you got three large lasers. I can probably out DPS you, but you also have a friend. Okay. Stay on target. Alright. Ballistics. Ah, scorpion. Alright, we gotta take care of the scorpion. Ignore the crap. I don't know how long I can stay here, by the way. Because that medium mech encounter with a light mech and a tank as well. Oof. Maybe I should call a battle buddy. God, I feel like I have no damage. That auto cannon 5. It deals Target damage. Destroyed. Don't get me wrong. It's not enough. Okay, Mr. Krabs. Let's go. It's Irby. What are you running? Auto cannon. Two. Oh god, it's a, it's, a, it's a sentry, it's a sentry, no! No, 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 no! No, 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 stay on leg, stay on leg, stay on leg. Go all in. Ah! Cannot afford getting reinforcements here. No, 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 no. You don't. You stay. No! Ah! God, we got 20 seconds to take this. Yeah, 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 whatever, whatever, whatever. Ah! Come on, Mr. Krabs. Got one leg. You gotta try to take the other. I'm gonna just stay here. Ooh, five seconds before the sentry, but we got him. Eh, uh, I know. There's an urban mech behind me, but he is behind the walls. So, that was very, very close. Where's Irby at? There's Irby at. Uh, let's go for center. We dealt some damage to him as well already here. Eh. God, it's messy. It is so messy. I think I have to stare him down as much as it hurts me. Literally. Okay. Good. Take you as well. I love the heat management on my mech. So that's the thing that's totally working. Uh, maybe I should call in a battle buddy. Maybe the Raven? Timpiki Dark. We found Timpiki Dark here. 
All right, who are you? Auto cannon two commando, huh? And so speed detected. Are you also a sentry? No, you can't be. All right, that's an interesting mission already, man. Medium lasers? Oh, behind me, huh? Was the turret probably? Okay, we are in laser range now. Get that thing real quick. And now on the commando, who seems to be stuck on terrain. Hell yeah, let's take him. Cool, he's down. We're already scanning, although we are not in the circle. Interesting. Didn't know that that could happen. Alrighty. It's another turret right here. Okay, 98, 100. We found some tier 3 weapons. I'll take it. Yes, yes, yes. Please, thank you. Another light mech coming in. It's a rifle commando. Bam, 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 bam. These ballistic commandos. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Alrighty. Just blow the man down. That's what we're here for. Ah, he stopped moving. Come on. Stop being so erratic. This guy's actually dealing damage to me. Yeah. Okay, so medium chemical laser is down. There. Yeah. Tanks as well. Uh, Alright. Just want to destroy the base defenses. And you know what? Since the commando is gone, we're going to focus on something else that we can actually hit here. So. Uh, it's kind of funny that the AI is so smart now that they are actually taking active cover. I love that. Okay, patrol coming in. Ah, what am I doing here? I'm fighting turrets that I shouldn't... that I don't need to attack, technically. Anyway, destroyed. let's go in. We'll take your arms. Where's your rifle located? I don't know, doesn't Target matter. Destroyed. So let's Target get out of here. Acquired. It's another tank coming. It's a carrier. It's a goblin. Ooh, so it's not a carrier. Um, that means he probably has armor. Compared to the usual carrier type units. Yeah, you can see it. We want to take him down because if he's coming in... He's gonna shoot his SRMs and we're gonna suffer. So let's take it slow. Play it safe. Come on. Come on! There we go. So that's a carrier. So we're gonna... Oops. We're gonna shoot him three times. A little too low, but anyway. Yeah. See? That's the difference there. Okay, okay, okay. So turret with small lasers. We're already scanning, scanning, scanning. Found absolutely nothing. Well, let's just go. Let's go home. Uh, that's a little bit of a bummer. But hey, we found some tier 3 weapons. I'm very curious to see what weapons those are. And we also have a medium rifle tier 3 now. I'm not a fan of rifles, to be honest. But they are lightweight. They're really good for, yeah, lighter mechs like our friend the Hollander. That is a pack, a double pack of LRM20 Stream Tier 3. Holy hell. It's a decent LRM5. We got the medium rifle, obviously, and an SRM6 Stream. I would say that was totally worth it. I'll take the crab hearts, although it's not the best crab in the world, but we might get the 250 rated engine, which I am not against. Um, auto cannons, why not? I think this is it. Urban mech? Uh, no. Big no on that. No, it's fine. It's perfectly fine. So, dealt a thousand damage, leveled up my missile proficiency. Interesting. And by the way, we already maxed out on shielding. Um, can you see it here? No, you cannot. Uh, go up here. Um, already maxed out on shielding, evasion, almost on heat management, but already on huh. <laughs> laser beams and ballistics. This com commander is getting really good. Good. Nice mission. Um, that means the Raven basically took no damage. That's a quick repair here. Shadowhawk is a bit damaged, but we can do it. The repairs, probably on another planet. So let's go ahead and play Head of the Attack. Or here comes the Cavalry. Oh yeah, that's good. That is absolutely fantastic. Am I interested in salvage? I mean... I think that's gonna be it, right? 
Because we are limited here. Sure, why not? Why the hell not? So Shadowhawk, not operable right now. Uh, I could take the other Hawk, but what I want more is I think the Kintaro. Let's go with that. It's a bit toasty. This is wrong. Uh, but it's gonna be alright. So yeah, Kintaro is hot, hot, hot. And again, I want it to be good, but we need some money and we need some time to actually rebuild that dude. And ultimately, it would be best to play towards the strength of the quirks, which is LRMs. Although SRM brawling is a lot of fun as well. But let's let's think about it. We have a hard point on the right side torso, a hard point on the center torso, and two missile hard points on the left arm. So I think we have a total of four missile hard points. We could just make it as LRM four, four LRM four. Eh, sorry, four SRM four, or four LRM five. Um, because these are very weight efficient, and then also use the two uh, energy hard points, which are on each arm, like one on each arm. We are walking so, right into the thick of it, Commander. Help I think I don't want to make it big launcher boy. As long as possible. But we could, because and we have two LRM-20 tier 3 now. <laughs> Good hunting. So let's go in. Something's wrong, Commander. There's Something's wrong. Oh, uh, we got mercenaries. Position. Let's go ahead and destroy those mercenaries. Your friends? No, they say eliminate. Where are you? I'm ready. Uh... Enemy dropship coming in right on top Hello. of me. You wanna drop? Oh, you are dropping, literally. Alright. Blurp. Alright, Commander. I'm in place for Stay on target. Heat. Blast him with the SRMs Complete point blank. Alright, so you were saying you Huh? What was your deal here? Gonna knock you. And I'm gonna kill you. Just to make a statement here. Oh, bad spread. <laughs> go home. <laughs> Just go home. I want to. I want to try something. See that? I think the mod made it so that melee attack doesn't work anymore unless you have a dedicated melee weapon installed in your mech. Kind of weird. Narc him. Um. Narc him. No, cannot narc him. Because I'm not hitting. Try again. Ah, let's just kill this guy. Ah. The narc does absolutely nothing, by the way. Other than target pain the dude. It's just... There's no... No benefit, really. I have the weapon and I didn't take it out yet. I might as well use that thing. Uh... Okay. Gotta make a breach. I know I should save my yeet, but I am a lazy guy, so let's make let's make that breach here. So enemies are coming in now. We're gonna have a spider here as well as a wasp. Got one LRM5 on the mouse button four. Gotcha. This mech is so damn toasty. Spidey already damaged. Let's damage him a little bit more. Alright. Yeah, you're not gonna go anywhere anymore. Okay, tell my people to attack the wasp while I'm... I'm gonna go for this guy. And again. Stupid trees. Go away, trees! I wanna hit the spider. There we go. Oof. Should I have a, a, a chain fire group? I should probably have a chain fire group for my SRMs. Alright. So yes, I need to cool down anyway, so might as well just watch this. And try my chain fire. Okay. okay, 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 okay. Looking good. Alright, let's see. By the way, I hope that the, the sound balance is right. I'm, I'm, I'm trying daily to optimize that a little bit, so you can hear the voice lines a bit better. And uh, the, the environment is not blasting your ears. Well, just a helicopter. Oh no, it's not just a helicopter. Eat my missiles, Mr. Phoenix Hawk. We want to wait for him to come a bit closer before we drop our Tango, SRMs, though. Be Hello. Yeah, because of that. Take the arms and he's gonna go. Or just blast him to pieces. Beautiful. Yeah, please, more of that. 
Oh wow, we have a we have a Phoenix Hawk with an auto cannon. That's pretty cool. Harasser, easy target, very little armor. Scorpion on the right side. I think that was just a bullet of an auto cannon five that passed me. Is that it? Yeah. All right, I send him over to the Scorpion because the Harasser is mine. The trees, stupid, stupid trees. That's okay. Okay, we're gonna help out with our missiles a bit. Bad news, Commander. Mm -hmm. More hostiles Five out of eleven. This guy is Get number six. And we have more enemies coming from the other side. Two medium X now, and a bunch of flyers. Ah, oh, that's the that's the rest of them. Target that is the one. absolute rest of them. Ow! Somebody is shooting auto cannon twos at me. Come on! Incoming Come on! Missile. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Ah, let's drop him. Good. And then you. Centurion. Don't want to waste too much heat on the helicopter. Ah, let's see. Assassin with SRMs. That's a nasty. Let's take him first. And I think we're gonna take him fast, even shooting my laser beams here. Got him. And now uh, the sand, and then we can actually go. Here we go. This, uh, this Kintaro actually needs love and, and help. And I think we can really make it good afterwards. Eh. Okay. Gonna make that shot count. Herbie, don't do it. No, we can't. Let's go. And we are done. And I'm not gonna intend to stay any longer because we don't even go for any crazy salvage. Most of the stuff that we went for is money. So oh, let's just go home. Unless there is something coming in. I don't know if I want to fight a Vindicator right now. Mm, the tank on the other side. I don't think it's necessary. I mean, we could stay. We have negotiated for um, damage coverage as well. So if we take a bit more, it doesn't matter too much. Or is we just gonna invest our time in a better way. You're clear to board it's fine. Number one. Welcome back. Hello. Oh, we missed? Interesting. The missile stopped tracking there. Huh. Alrighty. So, there's that. What would we get here? Maybe a mech part or two. Aren't we supposed to build an assassin? What was that again? Let's see. So, rival intel. Sure, I'll take it. Phoenix Hawk is a decent picker because we already started collecting those. Mm. Centurion AL. I don't really care. Those are very good SRMs, so screw the Phoenix. That's perfect. I could take Locust parts, Wasp parts, or more good weapon systems. Oh, I'll take him. Absolutely. So, three more picks. Get the money in form of jump jets. Or a locust. Or a spider. Uh, I don't know. Sometimes you are actually supposed to pick up um, jump jets for the cantina. So, I'm gonna take this one. That's fine. Let's not overcomplicate the things. Ooh, Irby. Irby got hit hard in the back. Ouchie, ouchie. And we get... Two medium laser tier 5, uh, one SRM tier 3, an auto cannon 2 tier 3, some ammo for it, and two million Z builds! That's exactly what I was looking for. We also killed some javelins, perfect. It's an SRM 2. I don't really care about the SRM 2s, but it's another upgrade point as well. Love it. So we got six points. <sighs> Should we go for something like that? Weight finds and salvage for Fature are reduced. Uh, I don't think so. That's not really relevant. I think the loot stuff is relevant. Scrapyard Foreman. Improves the state of assembled mechs by roughly 10%. And then by another 5%. Or improves the chance of salvaging equipment by 20%. That's, that's relevant. It's very relevant. I'll take it. Um, jumps are faster. I don't care about that. Repairs are cheaper and faster. Reduces armor repair time by 50%. That's, that's massive. 
And we have the mech bay upgrades, which we don't need right now. We're fine on that. Um, 10% cheaper and faster. Yeah, it's an overall save of money. Ooh, and we want that as well. Additional 30% cheaper and 10% faster. That's so relevant. Yes, absolutely. Uh, maybe I should have taken that over the loot. Uh, it's, it's okay. It's fine. So, there we are. We, we already have 4 million seabills again, and I'm very happy about that. But there's another mission that we can play here. So, let's take a look at the contracts. Infiltration. <laughs> uh, if you really want to kick over the beehive, we could do it here. But we should probably be sneaky in an infiltration mission early game. Osmaric doesn't pay well, and we are playing against our beloved independence. Mm. I'll be doing it anyway. Bit of extra pay out here. What are we looking for? 18 picks. You know what? I'm fine with that. The sensors are malfunctioning due to the weather. I'm totally fine with that. On this mission will be Her problem is, our well. Irby is Borkin, so we'll take... Uh, you know what we do? I'll go in with three mechs. We'll take the Thunderbolt. We'll take the Kintaro. Where's the guy? It's mildly damaged, but I think it's gonna be alright. And we're gonna take the Shadowhawk, and we're gonna drop this Raven. Kablam. Okay, ready to go. Let's do it. So I think the overall firepower is now actually higher. But I think our overall heat threshold is... I wanted to say lower, but maybe that's not true. Because we have a double heat sink kit on the, uh, the Thunderbolt. So our consistent, constant fire is maybe even better now. While also only running three mechs. The only thing that we are missing out on is experience on our elite pilots. So that's the thing that we don't get. We have like one guy that is not training right now. That's okay. I like these kind of missions. You know, we're gonna go in, we have some fun, we're gonna destroy enemies and see what we can salvage afterwards. And we can decide to stay longer or maybe not. And I think for the next episode, we are certainly gonna build our Kintaro and our um, Hollander. Because we now have a lot of money that we can invest. Actually, I have this one. And we got those as well. Getting mildly hot. Stay on target, get the kill. So perfect. Oh, feel strong. That feels bad. All right, let's go. Commando, um, LRM, no, SRM and large laser. My bad, I wasn't tracking him. Oh, by the way, he's narked now. Look at that. I mean, that's a combination. So he is not able to outrun me anymore. I always have the lock on him. There is a benefit to that. It's a good combo. Did I just put an AI pilot with a narc? somewhere on the battlefield and I'm gonna sit there with my LRMs. It makes it so that we have more reliable damage on the board, actually. Stay short, is it worth warriors. the, Ally command the three taunts plus one ton of ammo? Of a narc? I don't know, man. I don't know. So there's a harasser on the sidelines, which probably is stuck. So I'm gonna go towards him and wait for the helicopters to come to me. Sure thing. Let's go. Where are the helis? There we go. Found them. Zap. That's not a kill. Ooh, interesting. Ugh. Go around. Medium lasers. Got him. <laughs> and then you turn around and a roughneck stands right in front of you. <laughs> How did you sneak up on me? Oh my god. Um, yo friends. What, what are you doing? Where are you going? You're firing? No, you're getting fired at. At what? Our are you? Target is on the oh, alright. Good. Target destroyed. Firing missiles at fast movers oh, is a thing I, I really don't like. So... I, I, I intended to just shoot him, although I knew I wouldn't hit him, because sometimes they just don't know that we are here, but when they're getting fired at, they get in motion. So... That was something. Hopefully my friends can find the way and are not just coming back. 
like idiots. Copy. Don't pile on the target. Come on, you can do it. Can we do it? So yeah. Harassa down, Target that's important. Enforcer? What, with the sniper artillery? Wait a second, that's that's an XL build. You must have really that that, the that thing here, is dangerous. Holy hell. Enforcer. Look at that. Bunch of medium chemical lasers as well. What a build. Alright, let's see what he's doing. I hope he's just dying. The other mediums? Another light mech coming in. Uh, and I think he just blasted himself. He blasted the area in front of him. You could see there was a that big plume of smoke. Uh, might, have, might have been that he dropped the shell right yeah, in front of him. Okay. So, wasp and then. Then what? Oh, there they are. Cool. God, everything's smoking here. Eh. Let me go for this. Yeah, 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 sorry. Click the wrong button here. Was wanted to go for a heat manage, uh, for heat vision, which is H in MechWarrior Online, and H is airstrike here. Didn't quite get him yet. Nope. No. Ah, come on. I call shenanigans. He's cheating. He's clearly cheating. Right, another enforcer with a sniper cannon. Crazy. Go for center. Uh oh. No. Don't. Don't do it. Okay, here are the lasers. It's incredible. Oh, the heat. The heat, the heat. Let's go with the missile attack. It's a bit colder than our lasers. And we got him. Who's shooting me? Is that you? The fact that we cannot insta-kill them with the lasers is kind of mm, awkward. Nasty. Two more enemies. Yeah, you know what? We took a little bit of damage. We could probably actually go for higher challenges. I think we have the metal. I think we have the firepower. You're all moving to the right, huh? Ah, I see. Two tanks. Coordinating fire on your target. Two tanks coming in. SRM carrier. Down he goes. Complete, and we have a pretty close evac. That's great. I am very interested in those enforcer parts. Let me see what we can Victory salvage here. Ours, Prepare for evac. Easy peasy. Okay. So... Again, I think in the next episode, we're gonna start by going to another industrial hub and spend our hard-earned sea bills on our Kintaro and the Hollander. And we wanna try to make them as good as possible. I can really see that the Kintaro is gonna stay a long time in our lands. Let me see, what are you running? Ah. Uh, now it says AC-10 and large laser. I see, so it's a special variant that kind of drops back to a normal enforcer. Don't like that too much, to be honest, but okay. The weapon quality is low. Hmm. I guess what we are doing then is take the enforcer parts anyway. Maybe a part of a commando and then, I don't know, an LRM-10 or so. I believe we will just sell those. We are incapacitated for 96 days. Uh-huh. Took too much damage while resting, huh? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. But hey, killed enforcer. Oh, I'm so happy about that. Oh, that's another upgrade point. You know what? That's an instant invest into repair time and money. Yeah, we learned a thing or two. Pretty good. Yeah, guys, we're getting there. This is our current state of our our mech bay here, and I am I'm excited to get the Hellcat on the battlefield, and I'm very excited to actually take a look at Hollander and the Kentaro in the next episode. We've got 6 million Seabills to use, and I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel, it's completely for free. There's mech content every single day on this channel, and if you want to get the notifications, you can click that button, and I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.